Welcome to Vox Women, Carly. This is Carly Taylor from Australia. What attracted you back to Lotto Pseudo Ladies from Orica? Um, yeah, the last couple of years I've had a more domestic role um, in Lotto Bellasol two years ago, being the right hand man to Ashley Moorman, and then last year um, in Orica AIS to Emma Johansson. And um, I guess the opportunity to have a more leadership role um, this year on Lotto Sudal um, was really um, something that I wanted to go for. And um, yeah, it's going to be nice to try to get the opportunity to get a result for myself this year. What did you learn from riding as a domestique and, and how fulfilling did you find that? Yeah, I'm happy to give everything for a teammate and um, I don't always give 100% and I find it fulfilling to work for someone else and see them do well. It's almost as, it's just as good winning yourself when you're seeing someone that you've sacrificed yourself for to get a result. But yeah, I kind of, I like it. Um, Lotto Sadal is a very um, relaxed environment and the girls are all pretty funny and um, easy going. So um, I like this environment too. And um, yeah, two years ago was probably one of my strongest years and um, I'm going back to a team where I've had um, one of the best years on the bike. So I'm looking forward to this coming season. What are your target races this season? You mentioned you want to take on a leadership role and to progress yourself as a rider. So when are you hoping to peak? Um, yeah, well, in the first part of the season, um, the Spring Classics in particular that I'm focusing on would be Flesh Wallone um, and Chichiglio World Cup um, in Italy. Um, and also coming up, like, well, uh, Strada Bianca, which is the first time this year that they're going to have a women's race. So um, I think those three um, in the Spring Classics are um, my ones that I'll target. And then you, I'll start looking more in the Giro d'Italia and the um, Helia tours later on in the second, second part of the season. You've been involved in initiatives in Australia to get more women cycling. How important is it to you to see more women out there on their bikes? Yeah, well, like cycling is my life and so... I think that having women, more women involved in cycling, it is important for me. I think it's um, amazing that um, the th things like Gear Up Girl and SA promoting cycling for women is really good initiatives. And um, in the last year, like this summer, just passed in Australia, the amount of female cycling and just the level of female cycling in races has just jumped so much and it's awesome to see like um, and I hope it just keeps getting better and better.